Welcome to The Recon Trader. In today's video, I will show you how to capture profits from a deployed Qcoin grid bot. The way it works is the funds that you deploy with your grid bot, one of these trading grid bots on the Qcoin app, they lock up those funds in a sub account that you don't actually have access to. And you can see down here, this sub account has locked up the $500 that I deployed on the bot in addition to the $67 worth of profit. And in order to have access to these funds for trading again, I need it either in my trading account or I need to move it to my main account. And so in order to capture my profit, I actually have to stop the bot as far as I can tell. I've done some recon and that's the only way I can tell to actually capture the profit and put it back in my trading account. So from the app on your phone, unfortunately these bots are only available on your phone. I need to click on trading bot. And then you can see they have different bots you can set up like the classic or the DCA. Now, if you missed the video on how I configured this actual bot, now is probably a good time to shoot that subscribe button so you don't miss those videos in the future. But with that being said, you can check out the video in my playlist on how I set up and deployed the Qcoin grid bot. Now, if I come up here to the top of the screen under running, I have one bot that's actually live and running. So I click on that. And you'll see I have a classic grid bot going. It's been running for 23 days and it was trading BTC USDT. And one of the reasons I'm shutting the bot down other than to just capture my profits, the current price of BTC has moved out of my price range. So the bot's not actually doing any trading at this point. All it has is a bunch of buy orders open if the price were to move back down under 44,000. And so I'm going to take this opportunity since I'm outside of my trading range to close the bot down. Now, this will be the first time I shut one of these bots down on Qcoin. So let's give it a shot. And I'm just going to click on the power button. And it says, turn off trading bot. Are you sure? Are you sure to turn off the BTC USDT classic grid trading bot? We will return. No BTC since I don't hold any BTC plus 566 and change USDT to your trading account. And it appears like you could actually choose what to transfer. And in this case, I only have USDT. So I'm just going to let it go and click confirm. And you can see it's now stopping the bot and the bot did have 13% profit during that time frame. So it did win the battle in the long run. Now, if we jump back over to the desktop version of Qcoin on my computer, I can take a look at my asset overview and that sub account now shows zero dollars in the sub account. And we should be able to click on my trading account and see that it has increased by that 566 and change USDT, which is what we actually do see. So I had quite a few messages asking, how do I capture my profit from the bot? And as far as I can tell, the only way you can do that on the Qcoin grid bot is to actually stop the bot. And then at that point, it automatically transfers those funds back to your trading account. And then if you were to deploy a new bot, say with another $500, that $500 would be automatically transferred from your trading account to a sub account, which in this case would be your bot account and basically held until you shut the bot off. And I think that pretty much wraps it up. I just wanted to do a quick video to show you how to capture the profit from your Qcoin grid trading bot. And that's pretty much it. So if you like this video, do me a favor, spike a like. If you don't want to miss out on future videos, now is the perfect time to shoot that subscribe button, probably smash that notification bell. And until next time, remember, never send your money into battle without first doing your recon. See you in the next video.